हॅलो एव्हरी वन दिस इज अंकिता वेर्डे वन्स अगेन वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन माय यूट्यूब चॅनल आफ्टर अ सच अ लॉंग टाईम आय एम कमिंग विथ दी बॅक प्रॅक्टिकल व्हिडिओज अँड एस्पेशली फॉर दी सेकंड इयर डी फार्मसी स्टुडंट्स हियर आय एम कमिंग विथ दी फार्माकोलॉजी लॅब मॅन्युअल प्रॅक्टिकल व्हिडिओज सो वी विल स्टार्ट विथ दी फार्माकोलॉजी ऑलरेडी कम्युनिटी फार्मसी अँड मॅनेजमेंट प्रॅक्टिकल व्हिडिओज आर देअर इन दी चॅनल सो यू कॅन चेक दी प्लेलिस्ट अंडर दी चॅनल अंडर दी चॅनल अंकिता बेर्डे अंडर दी प्लेलिस्ट यू विल गेट दॅट कम्युनिटी प्रॅक्टिकल्स नेम ऑफ द प्लेलिस्ट प्लेलिस्टचं नाव आहे प्रॅक्टिकल्स ऑफ कम्युनिटी फार्मसी अँड मॅनेजमेंट सो त्या प्लेलिस्टमध्ये तुम्हाला ते मिळून जाईल देन नाव सी एक्सपेरिमेंट नंबर वन इंट्रोडक्शन टू एक्सपेरिमेंटल फार्माकोलॉजी सो द एम ऑफ द एक्सपेरिमेंट दॅट इज इट इज द इंट्रोडक्टरी पार्ट ऑफ द फार्माकोलॉजी दॅट इज टू बिकम फॅमिलियर विथ द एक्सपेरिमेंटल फार्माकोलॉजी सो इट इज व्हेरी व्हेरी नेसेसरी फॉर द ड्रग डिस्कवरी प्रोसेसेस अँड देर आर दी टॉक्सिकोलॉजिस्ट मायक्रोबायोलॉजिस्ट क्लिनिशियन्स आर देअर सो बट अमॉंग्स दॅट ऑनली द फार्माकोलॉजिस्ट can discover the potential therapeutic effect of any drug so uh, this is the introductory uh, part is there so this is the theoretical part of the experiment theoretical background or what is the history which is there that we are going to see here so in that there is a contribution of the many scientists uh, in that uh, francois magnite he is a french physiologist and uh, he was the first to use the animals in the scientific research so now we are going to see with the lots of the era with the lots of the development in the uh, pharmacology that is drug uh, when during the clinical trials it is studied in the animals so that name of the scientist that is the francois magnaid he was the french physiologist and he used the animals firstly in the scientific research then after that next uh, we are familiar with this name that is the uh, oswald skimberg so it is a, he is a german uh, pharmacologist and um, he introduced the concept of the pharmacodynamics and pharmaco kinetics that is what drug does to the body and what body does to the drug so these two concepts there were found by the oswald skimberg then uh, next is the R- rudolf bukem so he established the exper- first experimental pharmacology laboratory it is at his home and uh, there are the same main invention is that in the organ or the tissue bath which containing the physiologic salt solution and th- there is a aeration is coming that is oxygen bubbles are coming and uh, in that isolated organ or tissue that is cock ileum is there then uh, guinea pig uh, animal is also there so uh, he can stay there for the several hours that is it remain remain functioning for this several hours then henrik magnus he, he was the first to use this procedure that is above procedure is there that is in the organ bath there contain the physiological salt solution and there is a aeration is coming that is that are the oxygens are bubbled and in that um, isolated organs or their tissues are there so they remain there for several times that is for the many times then this procedure then <coughs> continued by the jean francois hemans on the mammalian heart he carried out uh, these procedures on the it, it this procedure on the mammalian heart then next is uh, the a uh, claude bernard he was uh, uh, on the isolated no muzzle preparation then uh, it is the history then after that scope of the pharmacology that is to find out the therapeutic agent that is drugs which are suitable for the human use then the study of the toxicity of a drug then study the mechanism of action of drugs so this is the scope of the experimental pharmacology then now see uh that is resources used uh, here we are basically for the pharmacology practical we are using the msbt uh, cds which is available in the institutes then uh in the resources used you can write down the msbt cd 
the next thing main part that we are going to discuss that is the activities so activity one is there so that table is there that you are going to see so you can take this screenshot of this or else you can write it down so the name of the scientist first is henrik magnus so here that see uh, we are, i had told so this henrik magnus he was the first to use the procedure that is in organ or tissue bath he used he that is in simple way how you can write down henrik magnus he was the kindly listen what i am saying that he was the first to use this that is in organ or tissue bath which contain the physiological salt solution and there is a aeration that is the oxygen bubbles are coming and isolated tissue or isolated organ for example cock ileum or guinea pig ileum so it can remain there for the several hours so this is the discovery and henrik magnus he used this procedure for the first time this is about the henrik magnus then claude bernard so by using the similar procedure that is above i had told that is in organ bath physiological salt solution is there and the aeration is coming that is oxygen is bubbled and the uh, organ or any tissue can remain there or function there for the several hours so an isolated nerve muscle preparations these were the significant advance in the experimental pharmacology so this is the discovery of this claude bernard then rudolf buchem is there so he established the first experimental pharmacology at his home in the germany in the year 1849 then next is the john jacob abel so he established the pharmacology department at john hopkins university of medicine in 1893 and they become the first full home uh, processor for cology in the pharmacology in the america so this is the discovery of john jacob abel and ramnath chopra so he made the beginning of pharmacological research of uh, the uh, drug in india and uh, uh, so uh, maybe you are know this name of the scientist that is the uh, sir ramnath chopra so that is uh, yeah in the indian pharmacy also uh, that is his contribution is much more that is and uh, we can say that is uh, he is the father of the indian pharmacology so this is your activity 1 so you can take this screenshot of this then now see activity 2 is there that is you have to create the chart of the landmarks in the field of experimental pharmacology so you have to make the chart so like this way you can make the charts that is uh, that is scientist name and his discovery so in this way see that is first is francis magnite so he was the first to use animal in the research that is in the scientific research then oswald schimberg so he is uh, uh, recognized as the founder of the modern pharmacology he was the first to introduce the concepts of the pharmacodynamic pharmacokinetic then you can write down the rudolf buchem so he established the first pharmaco first experimental pharmacology laboratory in the home in germany then henrik magnus so he was the first to use this procedure that is organ bath in the organ bath in uh, which contained the physiological physiological salt solution and uh, bubbles are coming that is oxygen bubbles are there aeration is there and uh, the organs or tissues can stay there for the several hours so this henrik magnus he was the first to use this procedure this procedure on the intestinal strip so you can uh, draw this chart for the activity 2 then so this is activity 1 and next is activity 2 then conclusion so after the experiment that is we are studied and understand the different field of the experimental pharmacology along with its history and scope we had seen the many discoveries in the field of experimental pharmacology then next see that is questions are there
फर्स्ट इज डिफाइन फार्माकोलॉजी एंड एक्सपेरिमेंटल फार्माकोलॉजी मच सिंपल डेफिनेशन दैट इज इट इज द ब्रांच ऑफ द फार्मसी फार्माकोलॉजी इट इज द साइंस विच डील्स विद द स्टडी ऑफ द ड्रग्स देन इट ब्रॉडली कवर्स द इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट द हिस्ट्री सोर्स फिजियोकेमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज मैकेनिज्म ऑफ एक्शन एब्जॉर्बशन डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन मेटाबोलिज्म एंड द एक्सक्रीशन ऑफ द ड्रग्स दिस इज द सिंपल डेफिनेशन सो दिस डेफिनेशन Uh, is can be asked in the viva it can be asked in this synopsis also then experimental pharmacology so it is relatively it is the youngest branch of the basic medical sciences uh, then electrophysiology biochemistry molecular biology and the electronic or the digital recording methods and the softwares which have all contributed to the enrichment and the broadening of the experimental pharmacology's frontiers simple definition is there the next uh, b question is there give the objectives of experimental pharmacology so the see these are the objectives that is to find out the suitable therapeutic agent for the human use then to study the toxicity of a drug then to study the mechanism of action of drug so these are the objectives of the pharmacology then now see next question c question is there mention the scope of experimental pharmacology so firstly scope is to find out therapeutic agent which is suitable for human use then to study the toxicity of a drug then to study its mechanism of action of drugs uh, this is the scope and the preclinical -cl pre experiment pharmacology which includes the identification and optimization of the uh, novel chemical lead structures uh, testing them for the biological effects on the animals and animal tissues or organs then clinical pharmacology which involves the uh, testing medications on the human volunteers and patients to determine their pharmacokinetic safety and the efficacy so this is the scope of experimental pharmacology then now see what is the question is there do you explain the different aspects of the drug discovery in pharmacology drug discovery cha aspects kutle kutle te tumhala explain karayche ahet manjats kay ahe tyachyamadhe ki jachyamadhe scientist konte ahet ani tancha contribution kay ahe that is scientist along with its discoveries along with its contribution is there so you have to write down this scientist that is similarly what you had done for the activity number 2 that is scientist name and after that his discovery then in this you can make this screenshot of this so in this way that is you have to write down it's very simple you can write it down we had already discussed it so uh, this is all about the experiment 1 that is uh, it is much very simple experiment introduction to experimental pharmacology we had discussed the activities are there and what are the questions are there so if you are interested to watch the more videos of the pharmacology experiments or uh, regard pharmacology experiments discussion of the activities and discussion of the questions and answers then please comment it on the comment box and if you like this video then please press the like button and if you didn't subscribe to my channel then subscribe first and press the bell icon so that whenever i will upload any new new video so we'll get the uh, notification of it happy learning and the share with your friends share with your classmates because sharing is like the caring thank you